So we're going on tour. Can we maybe um, go around in a circle and state our name? And one thing that we're looking forward to and one thing that we're scared of? Yeah. I'm afraid of nothing. <laughs> I'm very, very scared that I will get fake fired by Ryan Lewis. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Ben. I am excited to get back out on the road. I do enjoy performing quite a bit. I'm scared of being away from my family for an extended period of time that hasn't happened yet. Oh, we gotta go. You have the keys? She starts to walk, we'll fly out to see you, okay? And pick her up immediately so she can't walk. I won't even let her put her foot down. <laughs> Hold it down for your mama. Never Start fly. sleeping more. Here we are in Phoenix. We've been in the studio for pretty much a solid year and a half straight. We got some new additions, bringing Eric Nally, bringing the Massive Monkeys, got XP on the road with us, Carter on the trumpet. I had a brown paper bag, saying eyes on that motherfucker. Around the city we smash, Bible coming, then you know I'm running. Crawling the broken fences, when shit gets hard, you know who your friend is. And when I lose perspective, need to go to a place where I lose respect. You know, this is what you can help us. Yeah, help us. What have you been doing? Organizing boxes, taking them off pallets, using exacto knives, sharpies, labeling, using my new walkie-talkie, you know, schlepping. <laughs> Ooh, there's a lot of tape back there. Yeah, you know, for sure. Oh, it's a little. Uh, I mean, you you judge it, but. I don't think that'll be. You know what bare gaff on your bare skin feels like? Of it feels like this. Try it now. You got about another inch. That is perfect. All right. Second time in sharp. Yeah, about five minutes. So Something just scratched me. Show <laughs> <laughs> number one. Let it all hang out. Mm -hmm. Don't hold nothing back. Let's make it happen. Yeah! <laughs> Sorry I'm late guys, I didn't see an email, I just went off the fucking band calendar. <laughs> and now I look like a fucking diva on day one of the bus. Don't worry man. Who's this guy walking in? You guys announced to the world that you were engaged the other day. Where did he propose? The coffee shop that we would always meet up at um, in high school. And so we stopped to get a cup of coffee and I was already going down memory lane. And then he was like, let's sneak upstairs. And I saw a sign that it was closed for construction and he just ran up anyways. And um, we went out on the balcony and, and then he proposed. And it was so surreal. I was too comfortable. I was too comfortable making music, not because we had to, but because we got to. I yeah, I want to feel. I want to feel intrigued, and that was the first time that I was like, okay, mm -hmm. what the? And thinking of the with footage, the string or with the dulcimer? With the dulcimer. Man, come on. How you doing, man? I'm good, man. Good to see you, bro. 
What's up? What's up? Dr. P. Give me a dose of the American dream. Make some noise for Fort Worth, Texas. Oh, Liam. Preacher. tried to tell me how to live, but I didn't listen to him because my brain is like a sieve. <laughs> 27 million Americans under blizzard warnings. Six states have already declared states of emergency. Whoa, it's a snow day. Is the best. Best shit ever. Blizz. The Blizz Biz. You are the brave people that ventured out of your house in the snow. Let me get some of that big necklace to show you. I feel like I can rock that. It's a good investment. You heard it from the man. Do I tuck in my shirt or leave it out? Leave it out. You don't like the tuck in without a doubt. Without a doubt. Why is that? Do I not have the build? Does he answer truthfully? Does he keep it real? Does he say you're skinny but still kind of fat? Now what kind of rapper has a body like that? <laughs> You're very Dr. Seuss today. <laughs> yeah, it's not a Dr. Seuss. It's Edgar Allan Poe. <laughs> it's Edgar Allan No. Jason, you think I should play that Brad Pitt? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So much. <laughs> What you've heard of the album so far, what are you most excited about? You can hear the growth, you can hear like how how Ryan has grown and you can hear how Ben's grown and Budo, all of those guys, you know. So the collaborations, you know. It's dope. I, I got goosebumps. I'm done, I'm fucking done. I'm fucking on my lunch break. Like I'ma make it out this motherfucker one day. I was in the back, back seat of the bus before a Bluetooth. Got the boom box and a blunt boot like a deuce deuce. H on my crew, we get drunk. Great, great month with you guys on the road. Did we learn some things? Did we get better at our craft? Did we have fun along the way? Speakers bumping. I was on that book shut. Window to window and wall to wall. Can I cry on and we out the bar? Buck shot four in the morning, I'm with the squad. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go.
we go. Kill it. For the last year and a half, Ryan and I have been working on an album. It is finally done. It comes out on February 26th of this Recommend that you read The Alchemist. Listen to your teachers, but cheat in calculus. Tell the truth, regardless of the consequence. And every day, give your mama a compliment. Don't get too drunk hanging out the limo. Slow dance with your woman in your arms. Sneak her in after, but boy, you better tiptoe. Don't wake your mama. Do yoga. Learn about karma. Find God, but leave the dogma. Quickest way to happiness, learning to be selfless Ask more questions, talk about yourself less Study David Bowie, James Ball with a Tupac Watch the sunset with best friends from a rooftop Wear a helmet, don't be stupid Jaywalk, but look before you do it If it snows, go outside, build a jump, get some help Get a sled, all Fresh great things with your end friends till it melts. And um, festivals. they begin again in another world And another life, and another time <laughs> what he said. This is your chance. I'll be patient. One more.